And now, our feature presentation. from the cab accident is kicking ass in the stock market, so relax. Yeah, well, don't blow it all on worthless crap. I won't. You know what you should spend it on? Your bar exam. You're the lawyer in the family. I ain't taking a damn bar exam. I got too much other shit going on in my life. I don't know what the hell happened to you. Okay. Anyway, how are things going with your girlfriend? What's it? Vanessa. Things are going fine. Shit! I gotta go. I gotta go. Shit! Damn it. Turn off the alarm clock again. No, no, no. I mean, yes, I did, but I thought you needed more sleep, Vanessa. I anyway, shouldn't have stayed here. That was a real jerk thing to do. Thanks a lot. What are you doing? Why are you going to work? It's Sunday. I'm not going to work. I'm going to brunch with some potential clients. That's how a party planner gets business, by meeting people and making contact. <laughs> Meet with me. Come on, I'll order in from Cozy's. We'll have fun. I am sick of cozies. You order in from there all the time. The delivery guy's like your best friend. Well, he happens to be pretty damn nice. Oh, this is a rough patch of my life right now, all right? Syracuse is 0-3. I got those medical problems. Medical problems? <laughs> a cab runs over your foot two years ago? You spend one night in the hospital. First of all, that cab was huge. And a jury decided that one night of pain was worth $200,000. So there you go. <sighs> Whatever. What the hell's the matter with you? Why are you being so nuts to me lately? Because you refuse to move on to the next phase of your life. I, on the other hand, would like to have a family someday, but I need someone that I can rely on, not just a playmate. What do you need, a father figure? Stop pulling your sister's hair! You know what? I'm gonna go to Syracuse to see my mother. I'll be back on Wednesday. Well, what, what are you talking about? I had a call for a delivery in building, but I think it was a crank call. You want some chocolate cake? It's a bad time, man. If you come back later, I'll Indian wrestle you. You're going down, sucker. Yeah, well, we'll see about that. Okay, peace out. Well, what do you mean you're going to Syracuse? Because I need time to think, and so do you. What do I need to think about? Your life and why there's any reason for me to be a part of it. All right. While you're at it, why don't you think about getting a real job? I got a real job! Patrick Ewing, nice job. Hey, sonny. What's up, buddy boy? Yeah. I'm out the door. All right. Hey, pal. Where you going? Manhattan. Manhattan, you want to take me with you? Uh, I guess. All right, hold on to your money. Later on, pal. Okay, take care, son. See ya. Cadillac, I love it. Yeah, it's only me. It's only me. What's going on? Corinne's throwing a surprise going away party for Kevin. Well, why didn't she tell me about it? The roommate has a right to know. Because she knew you'd tell him and ruin the surprise. No, I wouldn't. Hey, surprise! 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 surprise. 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 What's going on? We wasted the good surprise on you. All right. Your handiwork? I guess. See you in three hours. 
Good to see you stiffs out anyway. What have you been doing? The last three weeks have been crazy at work, man. I've been in Denver, Dallas, San Francisco. I've been sleeping in the office. We're going to trial on the securities fraud case. Honey, it was a great surprise. I was totally shocked. No, you weren't. And I worked so hard on this. Need some help? Uh, honey, your sister's here. Hey, sweetie. I hate Sunny. So my client's out seven million bucks, and all we can sue on is breach of contract. Maybe you can try suing under the Foreign Corrupt Practices Act. I gotta get back to the office. Sonny, you're the king. Right on. Mikey, pleasure. I'll see you at home. All right. I'll walk out. I gotta admit, I'm still a little weird with that when they kiss. Why? They're gay. That's what gay guys do. Yeah, I know, but they were like brothers to us back in school. They're still like our brothers, our very, very gay brothers. <laughs>